Hello friends, welcome to Civil Services Menta YouTube channel. My name is Chandrasekhar. Today we are going to discuss about major battles in India that took place from the period 1757 to 1857. There are several major battles in India. Let us see one by one. First of all, the Carnatic Wars. So the war took place between the Americans and the Carnatics. So there are several wars. Carnatic War One. It took place between the year 1746 to 1748. Carnatic War Two. That took place between 1748 to 1754 and the Carnatic War 3 1756 to 1763 and in this war the results are the last war broke between France and English Sir eight Kote defeated French army headed by Duplex. English became the victorious in this Carnatic Wars. Next one is the most important battle in the Indian history is the Battle of Plassey, which took place on 23rd June 1757. This war took place between Sirajuddaula and the English results. Sujudola, the Nawab of Bengal, was defeated at Plassey by British Crown, headed by Robert Clive, and killed by Miran, the son of Mirzafar. The battle had paved the way for foundation of the English rule in India. The second most important war was the Battle of Buxar, which took place on 22nd October 9, 1764. And this took place between Mir Qasim and the English results. Mir Qasim, the Nawab of Bengal, Shah Alam were together defeated by the English. Treaty of Allahabad was signed on 16th October August 1765. British claim the masters of war. Robert Clive was appointed as Governor General of Bengal and Dakhan. The third major war was anglo mysore War that took place between the English and the Mysore kings Hyder Ali, Tipu Sultan, etc. The first anglo mysore War took place between in the years 1767 to 1769. In this war, Hyder Ali was defeated, they returned back conquer areas each other and the treaty of Madras was signed between them. The anglo mysore War II took place between 1780 to 1784. In this war, Hyder Ali was again defeated by English army. In the middle of the battle, Hyder Ali died due to cancer. His son Tipu Sultan signed the treaty of Mangalore. The Anglo Mysore War 3, 1786 1793. Tipu Sultan army fought with British army. His heroic fight brought no victory to Tipu, and he was defeated and signed the Treaty of Srirangapatnam. The last Anglo Mysore War 4 took place in the year 1799. Tipu Sultan fought against British for the last time but he was defeated and died in the battlefield and thus it was the end of Mysore Wars. The next one is the Martha Wars. The first Martha War 1 took place between 1775 to 1782. In this war Marthas were defeated by British. Nana Padnavis signed the Treaty of Purandar 1776, Marthas promised English to help them in gaining territories 
of Hyder Ali. The Martha War II, 1803-1805. In this war, Bosley signed the Treaty of Dorgon. Scandia surrendered territories between Jamuna and Ganges to British. Martha's handed over many places to British. The Martha War III, 1817-1818. In this war, entire Maratha Empire was surrendered to British. Remaining were made as dependents of pension. The last one, the last major war was the Anglo-Sikh Wars. The first Anglo-Sikh War took place between 1845 to 1846. In this army, the Treaty of Bhairwai was signed. The six were asked to pay 22 lakhs to English. This Anglo-Sikh War II took place in 1848 to 1849. Punjab was annexed by Lord Dalhousie. The Lip Singh and Rani Jindan went to England. A board of three commissioners, Henry, John, Charles Mansell, was appointed or constituted in 1849. The last important battle was the revolt of 1857 is also known as Sipai Mutiny War. In this war, the Mangal Pandey Indian Sipai refused to build cartridge which was applied with the Oxon Peaks fats. He killed a British officer at Blackpool on 29th March 1857. Mangal was hanged to death on 8th April 1857. Indian Sipais went to help of Bahadur Shah too. Sipai's revolter, led by Nana Sahib, John C. adopted a son after losing her husband, Ngadar Rao. Sir Hughes Rose attacked John C. for conquering out. The land of John C. was handed over by the government under the doctrine of lapsing policy. Ronnie died on 17th June 1858 in the battle. Thank you for watching the video. For more de videos, subscribe to www.youtube.com Civil Services Mentor or www.facebook.com Civil Services Mentor. Thank you very much.